Hello out there. This is DZ, your overlord, Desiran, and welcome to the good life. <laughs> okay, so we're in. We're here. It's finally time. The good life game that was on Kickstarter for by um, White Owls by Sweary65, man of deadly premonition fame, <laughs> or infamy, depending on how you look at it. Um, and it's a sort of similar premise, but a little di different. Um, oh man, let me just see here. Uh, general... Language English, yes. Okay. Sound, yeah, then uh, I'll, I'll deal with that as it comes in. Gameplay. Camera. Okay. So I don't see anything about, like, subtitles. Okay. So that's it. So, like I said, it was kickstarted, so there there is a thing here for backer backer credits okay let me just take a look i just want to see the good life this game was started with support from over 12,000 backers of the kickstarter campaign we send our gratitude from the bottoms of our heart to all of you oh i hope this isn't going to spoil anything Maybe I should wait until the game's over to do this. Especially since I think this um, song's probably copyrighted. Ah, screw it. Let's take a look. Chef, download learn now. So, they had obviously multiple tiers for backers. Immortal fans. And yeah, there might there might be there might be a, a little little bit of a reason for why I'm uh, showing this. It looks like it's is it alphabetical order? Sweary fans. I mean, Eric, George, John, uh, Storm. That's it. Ah. Uh, it's a nice, nice song. Dead villagers. <laughs> oh man. Dead villagers. Past villagers. It's a, it's a lovely song. It really is. Holy jeez. But. This at least gives some, uh, gives some appropriate, uh, appropriate thing for the backers. Appropriate, um, credit and respect and etc, etc. Holy jeez. That is a lot of names. Oh my god. Well, they did say 12,000. Uh, holy crap. Holy crap. So many names. I'm trying to keep track of where they are. Okay, we're not past M yet. S O. Oh, bingo! There it is, Overlord Desiran. <laughs> yeah, I did back this game. I'm, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest. I'm still waiting for my physical copy to show up, but they sent the digital copies, which is what I have here. I've been sitting on this for a little while, really wanting to, uh, really wanting to start this game. <laughs> 
And because I'm an idiot, I start with credits for the backers. But, I mean, come on. The game wouldn't exist without these people. Without everyone that put their hearts behind it, that wanted to believe in something Sweary was making, that his company was making. This has got to be the weirdest opening I've done for a game. And yeah, okay, this is a little bit, a little bit, just, just a little bit self-congratulatory there, because I did, you know. I did back the game, so my name's in the credits. Woo. Woohoo. What song's this? I wonder how many more names there are, jeez. They did say 12,000. Oh wow, that was another Overlord. I might need to remember them. Battle sometime. Holy jeez. Good person. Oh wow. So many. So many backers. He did say, what was it, over 12,000. So, you know, it's going to be a lot of names. And like I said, I'm going to try and talk over this as much as possible because despite the songs being awesome, I don't want to get claimed for them. So I'm going to try and keep talking and talking and just going and going and going. Which I'm not really good at. As you've noticed, I tend to get quiet a bit at certain times in my games. Because I'm not the best at uh, just talk, 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 talk. I'm not as, uh, not as good at just saying whatever. I usually go under an idea of, like, if you're gonna say something, have it, you know, mean something. Like, say something relevant. Don't just spew whatever's coming out of your mouth. But... I mean, we're being silly here. We're playing a game. So, you know. It's a little bit of a different situation. Oh my god, we're still in D. D and E. Yeah, this is gonna be... This... Is this the... This is probably the lowest tier, I'm guessing? Maybe? Not 100% sure on that. I also need to double check on my, um... Physical... Physical copy of the game, just to make sure... That they're still... Like, on... Like, they've taken... Um... What's the word I'm looking for? They've taken... Uh, da, 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 they've taken uh, addresses, etc. And uh, shipping payments. So... Now it's just up to... For when it arrives. Now I think they haven't sent any shipping details yet. They were waiting on that. So like no tracking number or anything has arrived. Which is why I'm going to have to look into it again. I'm keeping an eye on my emails. Oh my god, this... <laughs> this is the <laughs> I just realized this is going to be like the first ten minutes of the video. All just credits. This is the gameplay that you people come for. Because I had the dumb idea to show backer credits at the start of a game. Because it was there. Because I saw it and it was there. Well, that and because my name's in them. So, yeah. My hubris! Oh, God. Oh, my God. All the money, apparently. Oh, my God. They're still going with M. 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 So many M's. Oh, there's finally some N. N. Holy jeez. I'm betting this is the last one. After this song, that's probably it. If another song starts up... If another song starts up, I think I'll skip. Because there's a little skip option there. But I'm, I'm, I'm not expecting... I'm not expecting another song. I'm thinking this is the last round of backers. At least I think so. Maybe? Oh god, maybe it's not. 
There's more? Or is this just a short little thing? This might be just a short little thing. It is kind of giving you pre preview clips, though, for what's to come. I don't know anything about what's actually going on story- well, I know very vaguely what's going on story-wise. But... All I can really tell you ahead of time is that involves journalist, small town in England countryside, and mystery, and uh, cats and dogs. That's about it. That's about all I can give you. What the hell? This is getting weird. Yep, there we go. That's gotta be it, right? Yes. Oh man. Possibly worst decision I ever made. <laughs> but okay. Let's 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 no more delays. Let's get into this new game. Let's do this. <laughs> I just had to open with backers, didn't I? Oh. My genius idea to open with credits for the backers. I mean, okay, look, they deserve credit. I'm, well, I mean, I'm one of them, but we deserve credit <laughs> for bringing this game into fruition, allowing them to make it off of a crazy premise and because we believe and love Sweary 65. He's an, he's a, he's a, incredibly quirky developer <laughs> and we like that we like the quirk just like uh suda 51 I swear two peas in a pod there loading oh one day by a stroke of luck a poor orphan named dick whittington found himself a cat the two became close, and the cat proved very useful, working awfully hard for him. Before long, Whittington came to treasure the cat as an irreplaceable ally. And, sure oh, enough, how cute. after he offered the cat to a merchant ship, Whittington suddenly acquired a massive fortune. This changed Whittington's life forever. But... Whittington didn't simply use that fortune for his own benefit. He paid it back to the many people who had helped him over the years. Such philanthropy, coupled with his honest character, led him to marrying a wonderful wife. In time, he was even elected Lord Mayor of London. This is the story of Dick Whittington and his cat, one every good Brit knows well. However... Really? Is this a real thing? Whatever oh. happened to the cat once it had brought good old Whittington all his copper and joy, you ask? Well, nobody seems to know. Not even Dick Whittington himself. Hmm... Prologue. Rainy Woods. Alternative life or alternative universe Britain? I don't know. I know uh, anyone who's British watching this, let me know if any of this is true. Is this completely bunk? All made up? Is there any truth to like a, a legend or something in this? Wow, this is loud. Then again, it might not be that loud in the playback. I don't know. I will find out. Didn't want to mess with the sound immediately. I'll see how it how it how it turns out. Now loading. There's a lot of skip options. Well, this is it. Rainy Woods. The way you'd want to come here. They used to call it the happiest town in the world. But that was over 30 years ago. 
Now I hear it's just fallen to bats and full of weirdos. If I sightseeing you're after, you'd be better off heading somewhere like Windermere or Grassmere. <laughs> to eat your own, I suppose. Enjoy your holiday then! What a goddamn hellhole. This hey, Naomi. is Naomi Haywood, a photographer from New York. Now, why would someone like Naomi come to this far-flung corner of England? Because of all the interesting things to photograph, of course. That's the official line, anyway. Her true reasons lie elsewhere. A certain mm -hmm. client has asked Naomi to investigate a secret. And she's hoping oh. this job will help her escape a colossal mountain of debt. Oh. Who is this client? Well, that'll become clear soon enough. Let's just see what happens next, shall we? Well then, oh. are you ready? Ah! Don't they have pest control around here? You got any idea how much these sunglasses cost? Goddamn hellhole! Oh, hi. Welcome to Rainy Woods. This is the happiest town in the world. We're delighted to have you here. You're a little How creepy. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Hayward. I'm Elizabeth Dickens. I've been waiting for you ever since I received word that you'd be arriving in our town today. The Master Manipulators strike again. I beg your pardon? I wasn't talking to you, girl. What? G girl Anyway, girl, you know where I can find a place to stay around here? Somewhere that's got a clean tub, Wi-Fi, and room service? Don't you worry, Miss Hayward. I've got your house all sorted for you. My house? That's right. No room service, I'm afraid, but it does have a lovely garden. You can use the internet there, too. Hey, if you think you can rip me off, you're barking up the wrong tree. What? Oh, my. Rip you off? Oh, you're a funny one, Miss Hayward. That house is a gift to you from our town. A gift? Yes, a gift. Just what are you scheming, huh? <laughs> scheming? Why, nothing at all, of course. But it doesn't make any sense. Why would you give a free house to someone you don't even know? This is Rainy Woods, the happiest town in the world. We welcome everyone who comes to visit us here. What's more, I heard that you'll be staying with us for quite some time. In which case, it's only proper that you get your own house to rest in at night, now isn't it? But still... Oh, that's right. I've also already had your belongings collected from Town Hall and delivered to the house. How about heading there now so you can get yourself sorted? I'm sure you'll love it. You know, you're pushier than I thought. <laughs> well, I am the one in charge of our town hall. Mm. Anyway, as I said before, welcome to Rainy Woods. This is the happiest town in the world. Please accept my heartfelt welcome and make yourself at home. Okay. Destination icon displayed on the screen is your current destination. Head towards it in order to proceed with the story. Okay, leave it to me. Ho Main quest, home is where you make it. I see. And I'm guessing, can I just, yeah, I can just talk to anyone at any time. Help me out here. Hey girl, you know what? I changed my mind. Where's the nearest hotel? Oh my, is something the matter? I just can't get over how fishy this is. You're really going to give away a house to someone you don't even know. Is that really so out of the ordinary? This is the happiest town in the world, after all. Still, it doesn't feel right to me. Happiness is something that travels from person to person. So whatever you do for someone else will always find its way back to you. You sound like a crazy person. Oh, I'm sure you'll come to understand what I mean eventually. Ah, uh, I see. Am I, am I allowed to go inside? Oh my god, I am. 
I can do whatever I want. Freedom! Freedom! How do I run? Oh, it's a pub. Okay. Or a tavern. I don't know. Whoops. What'd I do? Oh! Oh, okay. So that's how I bring up my camera. Oh, there is running. Okay, L... No, R1. Hmm. Hello, random person. Oh, I'm allowed to talk, okay. Yes, I haven't seen you around here before. My name is Morris Downer. I run the Downer Hotel B&B. And due to being constantly pursued by the Angel of Death, I haven't slept for the past 30 years. I look forward to getting to know you. <laughs> oh. Okay. Let's see what they meant by crazy people. Why the marigolds? Uh... Precious camera, standard lens, take photo, display, display hot words. Hmm? Set up flamingo at, start up flamingo at home and check the hot words. Oh. Okay, so that's for selling photographs, I guess. I mean, I know, okay, part of the game from what I've... From what I heard, is going to be about like a, a, a part of this is kind of the whole debt thing. So there is going to be like a money making management aspect to this. Is that a cat? No, that's a rat. No, it's a cat. No, a rat. That's a rat. That's a mouse. So is this it? That girl's really giving me an entire house as a welcome present. I'm not dumb enough to believe this, but now I'm really curious. I guess I can't hurt to stop by and take a look at the place. Alright, we're here. It's not very far, thankfully, so... I suspect this game is only going to get weirder and weirder as we go. Naomi's house! I'm sure you'll love it. She's got some nerve. It's all dirty. The garden's a mess. This place is even more of a dump than I expected it to be. And it's not even close to the town. I'm in the backwoods. Within the backwoods. Oh, this is why you can never trust anyone who gives you something for free. But I guess on the bright side, it'll give me total privacy. <laughs> Considering the reasons I came out to this godforsaken place, it might be the perfect hideout. You've... yeah, you've got some issues, ma'am. Naomi. Meow. Seriously? Oh. Well, at least I have a computer. Destination home. Check Naomi's PC. Ooh, kitchen, door. Cook. We can cook. Check the wooden box. Potato. Root vegetable. It's practically a national food in some regions. It can be served on the side or even as the main dish. Cookable. No effects. Potato seeds. Plant in my garden. Um, excuse me? Oh my god. Is there going to be like a manage... Oh god, do I have to manage food and stuff too? Oh no. Oh no. Beauty care? Time for some beauty care? Cancel. Figure this stuff out after. Change clothes. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. I got hoodies. A hoodie with cute little kitty ears. Can be worn in cat form. What? Keep me up. T huh. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, that's all I have. Hoodie and stuff. So, there's this. Good life hoodie. Check out the paw print on the back. Can be worn as a cat or dog. Extra legs. Defense up. What's extra legs? What's that mean? 
How do I... Is there a way for me to, like, inspect that? Well, okay, I can rotate, but... How about info? Is that a thing? Sleep charge. Pretty cute little thing I can run over. Keep me up. Defense up. Extra light. See, I don't know what those mean. Okay, I, I'll leave it off for now. Oh, sleep. Shower. Should I take a shower? Nah, not right now. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go to the computer. Let, let's, let's, let's try and go for it. So, damn, slow. I know that feeling. First things first, I need to check and see if my clients sent me anything. What? Continue. Oh. Oh, okay. Rainy Woods Info Hub. Magic and mushrooms? Nice to see nice to see you. To see you. Nice. From the Rainy Woods Info Hub. Do you know the witch's forest on the west side of town? Some people say that honest to goodness witch lives deep inside. But could such a spine tingling rumor be true? Well, this is Rainy Woods, a town full of happiness where anything can happen. And if you're not spellbound by tales of witches and witchcraft, the forest is also a great place to try mushroom picking. We promise it's more fun than that weird teacher you had in secondary school made it sound. So throw on your anorak and give it a go. The hell is an anorak? But pick responsibly. Eating random mushrooms willy-nilly could lead to less than a less than magical experience. Be sure to take them to a restaurant and ask the cook there to prepare them for you. That's all for today. Have a good life. Well, you are automatically subscribed to Rainwoods Info Hub upon moving to Rainwoods. The moment you open this email, you are assumed to have agreed to our terms and conditions and privacy policy. Two, to unsubscribe from all future Rainwoods Info Hub letters and special promotions, please click here. Once you ha see the message, you have been unsubscribed, the process will be complete. If the message does not appear, please wait three to six hours and try again. Instantly, if you unsubscribe but are later deemed to be in need of information related to your safety in this town, we will automatically resubscribe you. Three, if you wish to change the manner in which you receive these mails or the language in which they are displayed, please pay a visit to our mailing services office located in Osaka, Japan. White Mails Inc. What? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Greetings from Rainy Woods Info Hub, your source for all things Rainy Woods. This week's gourmet spotlight. Treat yourself to the ultimate mushroom cuisine. Throw one back at the top pub in Rainy Woods. The ultimate mushroom cuisine. If you got a hankering for a shroomy dish, then head on over to Mushroom and Evans, where their meals are curated by the town's very own genius cook and mushroom maniac. You'll question their legality when the mushrooms dance across your palate like the jewels of the forest they are. A word from the chef. Good grief. I'll have a mountain of mushroom pasta and piping hot pies waiting for you, so pop in any time. The top pub in Rainy Woods. Here's a question for all you pub quiz masters out there. Name one English town that doesn't have a great British pub. Okay, so it was a pub. We bet you can't. Even in the middle of nowhere, Rainy Woods is no different. 1977 will set you right with fresh ale, ice-cold lagers, and hearty stouts. So be sure to drop in and wet your whistle. A word from the bartender. Just shut up and drink, man. <laughs> That's all for this issue. Have a good life. And same thing. Okay. Lucy Turner. Hope you arrived safely. safely. Flamingo account registered. Oh, should I have started at the bottom? Dear Naomi Hayward, this is Lucy Turner from Morning Bell News. I'm sure you've already heard about the new photo sharing service that's taken the world by storm, Flamingo. It has a new type of system where you can make money through advertisement fees paid out by sponsors based on the number of emokes you earn. <laughs> I thought it might help you pay off a little of your debt, so I made an account for you. The app is also already installed on the old PC I sent to your house, so after you read this mail, Start up the app and give it a try. I'm rooting for you, and I'll always be here to support you do support you along the way. Morning Bell News, CEO's Office, Special Correspondent, Division 2, Lucy Turner. Lucy Turner at Division 2, Morning Bell, XYZ. A photo. Main quest. A photo for Flamingo. Okay. So I have 500 pounds? Is that what it says up there in top right? 
Dear Naomi Hayward, this is Lucy Turner from Morning Bell News. If you're reading this, you must have safely made it to Rainy Woods. I'm sure you must be exhausted after such a long trip. So exactly what sort of place is the happiest town in the world? I'm sure it must be like stepping inside a fairy tale. I wish I could go and see it myself. But of course, we didn't send you there just so you could enjoy a relaxing, idyllic vacation. We want to know why people call it the happiest town in the world. Your job is to bring that secret to light. As I'm sure you know, the current amount you owe our company is 30... Whoa! 30 million pounds! That's so much. I couldn't believe my ears the first time I heard about it. But don't worry. This is your chance to make that astronomical debt disappear in the blink of an eye. During your stay in town, we here at Morning Bell News will send you a series of job requests. We'll pay you handsomely for each job, so be sure to use a portion of your profits to help pay off your debt. By the time you manage to complete all the jobs, I am sure you'll have managed to pay everything off. And of course, even if you don't manage to do all the jobs, as long as you can unveil the town's secrets to us, we promise to pay out the full reward for all the requests combined. I'm rooting for you, and I'll always be here to support you along the way. Morning Bells News, Lucy Turner. Secrets of the happiest town in the world. Flam Flamingo, huh? I hate apps like this, but if it'll help me make money off my photos, then I might as well check it out. Guess I should update a upload a photo and test it out. Oh, I don't have any photos yet. Uh, hot words. Kids with glasses, cute and fluffy, funky old ladies, flower pot overload, warm soup. Huh. Well, I don't have any photos yet, so... Oh, I do have a photo. Display tags? Doesn't have any. Upload this photo? Sure. Even the internet out here is prehistoric. This is why I hate the boonies. If I sit and wait for this to finish uploading, I'll be here until the sun goes down. I just head back to town center and start doing some legwork. Take a picture. Naomi is a professional photographer. If you find any subjects worth photographing, don't be afraid to snap a few shots. Aim with L2, press R2. Take a picture. See? It's easy. Once you get used to it, try holding L2 and using R to aim for a different angle. Once you're all set, just press R2 to activate the shutter. Tags. In camera mode, you'll see green plus marks next to objects and people if they're properly in frame. If you center in on an object or person, green words known as tags will also appear. Tags are important hints to help you complete certain quests and fulfill certain hot words. After taking a picture, you can press L1 to check the picture and make sure it has a tag you were after. On Flamingo, there will always be a group of hot words listed with hashtags that can help you earn the most emokes possible. Try to make each, pic each picture incorporate as many hot words as possible in order to earn the most emotes. Hot words reset at midnight on Mondays and Thursdays, so don't forget to upload your photos before that happens. Home is where you make it. Complete. Okay. Main quest. Photo for me. Upload a photo to Flamingo. So... Oh god, okay, time's going by. Oh wait, I have me I have mail. Oh okay. Main quests. Uncover secrets of rainy woods. Side quests, I don't have any shrine missions completed. Okay. Oh and I have an inventory. Plain scone. Potato seeds, potato. Compact first aid kit. Dead bull. Dead bull. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. So I have a hunger thing, and then... Oh, my God. Okay. Okie dokie. Over-the-counter drugs. Oh. Important stuff. Camera. Oh, my God. Cameras and lenses. Oh, my God. Oh, recipes? Buttered toast. What the hell? Oh my god. So many recipes. Load data, general luggage, title screen. So, choose a save file to load. General. So is it only autosave? Oh no, I can save. No, wait, no I can't. 
Load data, general data. Oh god, can you not save manually in this? World map, oh wow. Uh, how do you save? That would be good to know. If possible. Warp to house. Switch. Speed up. Okay. One like. Earnings. A s point zero one pound. <laughs> Okay, okay, fine. So, warm soup, flower pot overload, funky old ladies, kids with glasses, cute and fluffy. Huh. Okay. Let's... Let's try and get a picture or two. Just before I call this an episode. Since I did open with the whole credits thing and all. Also, we're on a timer. So I shouldn't just go dilly-dallying around. Oh, wait. Am I going the wrong way? Wait. Which way is town? Whoops. Uh, okay. Yeah, I want to go this way. <laughs> so one of the hashtags is flower pot overload so if I can find a whole bunch of flower pots in a row then maybe that's a thick what check mint seeds mint seeds all the nutrients condensed in these seeds can make them ten times powerful as a leaf can be used in concoctions Okay. Huh? Check. Rosemary seeds. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Can I? Am I allowed to? Can I jump her in? Oh, I can't. <laughs> I can't jump, but I can. I can. I can prance. No parking, please. Okay. All right, rat. Hmm. Okay, rat, you're bothering me. Let me try this. Let's see what we can do. Brown mouse. Rubbish bin. Huh. Ooh. A rat. What's this? Coarse beetle. A beetle with coarse texture. Seems like it might taste bitter. Can be used in A beetle? I'm not gonna eat a beetle. What the hell? Hey, mouse. Boop. Alright, let's... Oh! Okay. This might actually be better. Aha! Boom. I bet that'll go for flower pot overload. Uh, photos? Wait, no. Do I have to go back to the computer every time? Oh no, I do, I think. Or don't I? Uh... Camera? No. Warp home. Okay, so I can just warp home at any point. So... That's probably what they want. 
Wasn't there something about warm soup and kids with glasses or something? Oh, hi. Hey, kid. What's up? If I can get her and the kid together in one shot, damn it, it's not gonna work. Oh, maybe. Boom. Let's go with that. Oh, damn it, the kid was there. Okay, let's try. Oh, that was a kick. <laughs> Apparently, I can kick. Okay, let's try, uh, eh, warp home. You'll lose one hour. Cancel. An hour's worth of energy. I can just walk. Sage seed, okay. Walking won't take me an hour. Oh, I see. This is the sandy caterpillar. Ew. Oh, and here's the garden. Oh, guess what? You can plant seeds in your garden. If you plant a seed in your garden and wait over a day, it'll start to grow. Once it fully grows, you'll be able to harvest it as a material. You can also carry objects into your garden and decorate it as you wish. Your garden can only hold so many objects, though, so be careful. Fine. Check. What should I plant here? Plant something. Uh, potato seeds. I'll plant the potatoes first. In a row. Oh, no. Okay, hang on. There. Dang it. There. Plant. Okay, so I'll keep each thing separate for now. Plant. Mint seeds. Well, these are all like, um... Rosemary. Oh, did it again. I guess I was facing that way, but still, sage. So those are all like herbs. Alright. Let's get in there. Go to Flamingo. What? <laughs> Miss Hayward, do you have a moment? Seriously? Did. Whoa! Where did you come from? It'll be a full moon tonight. So I must ask you to refrain from going outside. Huh? It's still a bit too early for you. Once the moon begins to rise, I must ask you to return home quickly and stay indoors. And why exactly do I have to do that? Because I've asked you nicely is why. You mustn't go outside at night. If you would. It's for your own good. Uh-huh. Don't go out tonight. Wait until evening. Well, I mean, I'm going in, so... Now loading. So, okay, I'll upload photos. Upload. Uh, this one. Yep. Okay. Oh, uploading. Oh, photo successfully uploaded. Okay, people like that one. Upload. Kid. Upload the old lady. Upload the mouse. And just for the hell of it, we'll upload that. And C 
see how this stuff does. I'm curious now. Okay, so this one got flower pot overload. Okay, good. So this one should have kids with glasses. Yeah, oh no, yeah, kids with glasses. This one will be funky old lady. No? No funky, that's not funky old ladies? Okay. It's not cute and fluffy. That's not fl okay. So these two are the only ones so far. Damn it. All right, fine. I'll see what I can do later for more pictures. Um, seriously though, how do I say, is there, like, does it only autosave? Um, maybe if I take a shower or something, it'll save? I feel so refreshed. Alright. Oh! Something happened. Do I have new mail? I do have new mail. And it was from the bottom up. Dear Naomi Hayward, this is Lucy Turner from Morning Bell News. As written in the subject, your first job is to take pictures of certain inhabitants of the happiest town in the world and upload them flamingo. Of course, we don't want you to run out there and photograph any old person. First, we'd like you to start with the town hall employees. William Dickens, Rita Barrett. I'm sure they'll be happy to cooperate. Once we confirm the photos you upload match up to our list with our list, we'll deposit your reward. 50 pounds. P.S. I know that you don't have the most stable internet out there, so I don't expect you to reply to me every time, but don't worry. I've always got my eyes on you. Okay. VIP photos, number one. S save for later? Switch quests at will from the quest list. When you discover a new quest while working on an existing quest, a prompt will allow you to continue your current quest or pause it and start the new one. If you want to wait or start the quest later, you can choose save for later. You can switch between quests any time through the quest list in the main menu. Selecting a quest may change certain characters' dialogue, so if you feel like characters should be responding to you in a certain way, try switching your quests up in the quest list. Oh. Okay. Um. Alright. Let's eat something. Nom. Nom. Okay. And I mean, I'll call the first episode here. So. Stamina regeneration briefly. So, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, a comment, subscribe if you want to see more, and share it with anyone else you think might enjoy it. If you want to suggest a game, leave it in the comments below, and check out links in the description for The Good Life on... Not going to click that. The girl told me not to go outside at night. Okay. The Good Life on Steam, although this is the PS4 version that I'm playing. Also, as a side, um, link in the description there for a uh, fr uh, friend of mine I met a couple months back now, Neko Katako. Uh, streamer, Neko, awesome cat girl person. <laughs> um, it's just basically a very kind person that's been very helpful to me lately and uh considering a theme that's in this game you can see why i'll be shouting them out on this one and actually one other game that'll be coming in the future uh believe me it'll be thematically fitting to who i'm shouting out in this case so uh link in description for their twitch channel go check them out actually and their youtube go check it all out you won't regret it and in the next part, well, we'll find out what this is all about. This whole not going outside thing. And I'll see if I can figure out how to save. <laughs> so either way, until then, this is DZ, your overlord, Desiran. You all have a great day. And I'll see ya. Ah! <laughs> <laughs>